Hi, welcome to Krebs World. Myself Kartika. Today we will be discussing few questions in microbiology. Question number one: The causative agent of anthrax. Option A: Salmonella typhi. Option B: Vibrio cholera. Option C: Clostridium tetani. Option D: Bacillus anthracis. And option E: Leptospira interrogans. Here, the right answer is option D: Bacillus anthracis. Bacillus anthracis is caused in a clinical condition to pair on anthrax and there are three types under cutaneous anthrax, intestinal anthrax and pulmonary anthrax. Either route is a causative organism and depend on this type of anthrax and decide. Then, anthrax is a peculiarities in the anthrax. It is a bioterrorism agent. So, terrorism purpose in the way you use a chance of uh, biological outlaw material and bacillus anthracis in the way. Then, staining morphology is bamboo stick appearance. In the culture plate in the way, penicillin containing outlaw culture plate is in the way. That is the way, string of pearl appearance. That is the normal culture plate is the growth colonies in the side microscopically focus in the way. Medusa head appearance Medusa head appearance is interlocked diet hair and appearance. Our appearance is the Because it is long diet uh, large bacilli is the appearance Then Salmonella typhi is cause in a clinical condition of typhoid. Vibrio cholera is the cholera and the condition. Then Clostridium tetani tetanus is Clostridium tetani cause in a disease in a reason it produces in a toxin on a tetanospasmin and were in a toxin. It also is a neurotoxin on Then leptospira interagents cause in a disease on a leptospirosis. Are the mild infection with a serious cycle of wheels disease were a cause here. Question number two Which of the following is spore forming bacteria? Spore forming bacteria is the question. Option A Staphylococcus aureus. Option B Salmonella typhi. Option C Clostridium tetani. Option D Bacillus anthracis. And option E both C and D. This is Clostridium tetani and Bacillus anthracis. Tandem spore bearing atlas organism. So right answer is option E both C and D. Clostridium tetani produces in the spore cell in the edge. Line. So terminal spore is bulging and round diet shape. So Clostridium technique is drumstick appearance. Then Bacillus anthracis. Bacillus produce non-bulging central oval spores. Then Bacillus anthracis obligate aerob. Clostridium technique obligate anaerob. Staphylococcus aureus salmonella typhi non-spore bearing organisms. So the right answer is option E both C and D. Next question number 3. The disease caused by Clostridium perfringens. Option A. Tetanus. Option B. Typhoid. Option C. Kala Asar. Option D. Polio. And Option E. Gas gangrene. If the Clostridium perfringens cause in the disease, right answer is Option E. Gas gangrene. Tetanus cause in the Clostridium tetaniana. Typhoid cause in the Salmonella typhiana. Kala Asar cause in the Lishmania parasitiana. Then polio cause in the polio virus. Pick coronavirus daily where in the polio virus. Then gas gangrene and clostridium perfringens cause in the. This is a severe article, clinical condition. Next question number 4. Zeal nuisance staining is used for the identification of DASH. Option A. Flagella. Option B. Acid fast organisms. Option C. Volutin granules. Option D, bacterial capsule and option E, none of this. Here the correct answer is option B, acid first organisms. Acid first organisms and the varnala, have the cell volume of mycolic acid could be a property, acid fastness. A property of the organism is acid first organisms and the varnala. So acid fastness and the varnala, stain at the bacterial cell, acid or the same, decolorization prevent the genome. Angan yola cellular and acid fast cellular in the varanada. E stain retain G and help in the mycolic acid. 
So acid first organs then demonstrate you have to use in the method and zeal nails and staining. Then flagella demonstration when it in direct methods and indirect methods and direct method le direct flagella and demonstrate in the other reuse method or all wet methods so halangila silver impregnation methods so you see here. Indirect method is motility and demonstrate in the motility demonstrated the rainbow that means indirectly means that flagella is present. Then volutin granules under volutin granules in a demonstration you see in the Albert stain, Nisa stain, and Ponder stain. Then bacterial capsule demonstration in negative staining and you see in the negative staining in the summit the number could detect the end of the capsule and stain that the number two background diacum stain at another. Other than negrosin staining or indening staining one commonly use another. So here the right answer is option B acid first organisms. Now question number five. Which of the following organism give positive reaction in both catalase test and oxidase test? Catalase test to oxidase test is positive that is the organism question. Option A Staphylococcus aureus. Option B Streptococcus pneumonia. Option C Nicenia meningitis. Option D E. coli and option E Salmonella typhi. Here E. coli and Salmonella typhi are endobacteria shape family of organisms. Endobacteria shape all of them are catalase test positive and oxidase test negative. Man. Then Staphylococcus aureus and Streptococcus pneumonia both are gram positive organisms. That is Staphylococcus aureus catalase positive, oxidase negative one. Streptococcus pneumonia catalase negative, oxidase negative one. Then option C Nyseria meningitis is a correct answer. Both catalase test and oxidase test positive vitola gram negative cocci and Nyseria meningitis. So that's all about this presentation. Thank you for watching the video. Once again, thank you from Krebs World.